Hello everyone, this is Amr once again with a new Power Query Challenge. Today's problem is much easier than the previous one. Let's go direct to Excel and have a look at the problem together. In this Excel workbook, I have two tables. First one containing the employee's data. If you look at the design table, it's called data. It contains four columns, name, ID, band, and department. I also have a small table here called filter list. I need to input a value from this department column inside this filter list. And then using Power Query, I'm going to filter this table based on the input in this list. Let's try together. I'm going to enter finance, right click and refresh. And here you go. All the data belongs to employees inside finance department. Let me add another department to the list. Let me add sales, right click and refresh. Here you go. I have the data for departments, finance, and sales. If you look at the original data I have, it is in proper format, meaning that it has a capital letter at the beginning of each word. Something like supply chain, S and C are capital, marketing, M is capital, information technology, I is capital, and T is capital. However, while searching any value inside this column, I'm going to ignore the case sensitivity. You know that Power Query is case sensitive, so I want to deal with this case sensitivity. And while searching, I'm going to ignore the case sensitive so I can reach the department regardless of the way I input the letters, small or capital. Let me try something like legal in capital letters. Right click and refresh. It's working perfectly regardless of the case of the letters. Rules are very simple for this challenge. You just need to solve it using Power Query. You can use either the user interface or the M language. If you manage to solve the problem, send me the solution on the email that is going to be presented on the screen right now and also use the subject presented on the screen as well. In the description box, you can find the link to download the Excel file and also you can find my email. If you manage to send your solution or even a trial of the solution, I'm going to give a shout for your name at the end of a solution video that I'm going to publish next week. Waiting for your contribution and best of luck everyone.